Oh, well, looks like the wormhole did work then. <laughs> Welcome back guys, today we'll be playing some more Anthem like I promised in the last video. So today guys we'll be doing one stronghold and we'll be opening two caches at the end in hopes for a masterwork or two. So some of you guys have requested me to play more games than just Anthem. So if this video hits 5 likes, I will do a Roblox video with all my friends. I am not kidding, I will put myself through it. Just to entertain you guys all right so before we get into the video guys i just want to say thank you for all the support and all the feed all the good feedback on my live stream and my most recent video it's greatly appreciated and it's really motivating me to do more more youtube and pushing me to do more content to make more and better content for you guys so i just want to say thank you for all of that and also, as well, there'll be more games on the channel, like Call of Duty Black Ops 4, Grand Theft Auto 5, Skate 3 videos, um, and games that you guys have requested. So, drop a comment below, give me some feedback on what the video was like, and uh, tell me what games you want me to play. With all that said, let's get into the video. Alright guys, so like I said, we'll be doing one stronghold in this video, and it's going to be... Alright, so the Temple of Scar Stronghold, let's just track that. So guys, this is the first stronghold that you're able to do in Anthem. So as you can see guys, we're using a different javelin in this video. Last video I, I used the Colossus, which looks like Hulkbuster with a blue, white and black paint job. But today we're using the Storm, which I customised with this amazing paint job right here. So this is my loadout right here, if you want to take any ideas, if any of you do play Anthem, if you do, big up. Let's get inside, let's go. By mistake guys, the Temple of Scar isn't the first stronghold that you can complete, it is the turret mine. Right, watch this animation, ready? Don't tell me we're the only two people doing this mission. So from my personal experiences, strongholds tend to give you amazing loot. Which is why I'm completing it on the Storm Javelin, my lowest power javelin. God, I hate it when this game actually doesn't give you the right amount of teammates to work with. Cheers, buddy. So like I said in the last video, this is the masterwork that I bagged in the original return video that went corrupt, unfortunately. This masterwork works brilliantly with the storm because the masterwork enhances elemental ability damage. Or you will be overwhelmed. What a vague description. One down. I start. All of the javelins in Anthem are highly customizable, and these are only two of two or three of the abilities that Storm is uh, that Storm has to offer. Done. The Storm is quite a unique javelin because it has advanced hovering abilities, so it can just rain down ice, fire, or electricity on your enemies. Like this. There we go. In the last video I didn't show off the Colossus ultimate ability, which I am annoyed that I didn't. Right, first chest, here we go. What do we get? Two, three purples. Finally full squad of four teammates. Fuel cells gathered. Oh, we have to blow open the door, it seems. The thing I like about Strongholds is because it reminds me of Destiny 2 strikes and raids quite a lot. I think this 
masterworks and main abilities, killing elite enemies enhances elemental damage. So if I kill this enemy here... See, in this game as well, you can pull off combos with your abilities. Alright, place explosive, here we go. See, I forgot about this weapon, I was using my masterwork so much. I probably need to change this weapon though. Alright, so I'm going to use the ultimate ability here. God, that is powerful. Another purple. Pretty good. Next chest. Let's go. Couple more purples and one blue, I think that was. Oh no, green. Freelancer, no naughty language. This is a PG friendly channel. PG family friendly. Keep it clean. Oh god, I'm in a bit of a sticky situation here. I don't, I don't want to waste my ultimate ability though. Why you guys are at it? Can you go hit the like button on this video and drop a comment? another challenge done. Here it is, the big boss. Big robot spider thing. A thing I can see with this game as well, it's taken a lot of things from Destiny. It's been inspired by Destiny a lot. No, 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 no. Ah, you're kidding. Right, here we go, I'm able to respawn, that's a, that's a good feature. Whoa, 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 whoa! Who just did all that damage to the boss? Jesus Christ! Alright, these are the caches that I wanted to open with the Elysian keys, so I'm gonna go with this one. Elysian artifacts, okay. Right, now let's open this one. Another Elysian artifact. Alright. Stronghold completed. The Temple of Scar. Expedition complete. So guys, this is all the loot that I got from the Stronghold. Not as good as I really expected it to be. So, I'm level 26 now and I need to unlock the final javelin. Which is the Ranger. Ranger Javelin Unlock. Commonly used by frontline fighters, this reliable javelin has an easy balance of armor and speed. Alright, well, it seems like I've found a glitch here. It looks like the Colossus armor plating is merged with the Ranger, which is odd. So, level 3 Common Ranger. Hmm. I'll be back with you guys once I've upgraded it to its full potential.
before I forget guys, I'd like to give a shout out to one of my friends, Sam. And his channel will be in the description below. Go check him out, he does awesome videos. He deserves more subscribers. Alright, so, thanks for watching guys. I really do appreciate your support once again. I hope you enjoyed the video. It was actually a proper video this time, not just educating you on why I was gone. So, once again, five likes and I will do Roblox with my friends. See you all in a bit.